it is Bayern Munich four, Manchester United three. Manchester United lose their first game and returning back to the Champions League against Bayern Munich, not gaining the three points after one one entertaining game for the neutrals but for me as a Manchester United fan oh my god mistakes players cannot pass so many situations happening in this game bruv but no 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 Manchester United did what they did be usually just being Manchester United scoring and conceding goals then conceding again and scoring the goals it's just madness. You hold your fault. Wait a minute. Four free? We scored three goals at, at the Allen Serena. We didn't we didn't leave out with nothing. What kind of nonsense is this? But Manchester United there, oh my god. And I reckon Eric Ten Hag was fuming. Defensively, we was poor in midfield, ran through several cases, and several occasions as well. Oh my god. I, I just don't know when it comes to Manchester United, you know. Defensively, goals that we concede um um, cut backs and slapping it in the bottom neck. Oh, well, goalkeeper Onana's looking suspect. Oh, Nana. Oh, Nana. Susie, what's your name, bro? Because I don't think you know what your name is. Because, indeed, today you had a poor game. Well, I would say one of the donkeys of the match for today, guys. Like, Onana, boy, 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 boy. You, you just like making mistakes. Mistake is your thing. You Are you related to mistakes, sir? Because you just love making them. Like, we thought we got rid of David De Gea because he was making mistakes. But we went to get another goalkeeper that makes mistakes. Oh, nah, nah. Oh, you looking suspect. And I want to know what your name is. But you look at Manchester United against Bayern Munich. Yes, we didn't expect to beat Bayern Munich. We asked to God, we prayed to God, please, let's not get humbled. Like, let's lose respectively. And we lost 4-3. We lost respectively as well. So, I can be proud with Manchester United as well for for the result you didn't embarrass us but the performance wasn't that great as well you look at the first 45 minutes with Bayern Munich as well Manchester United were poor in that 45 minutes 2-0 down you know Bayern Munich was in second gear throughout the whole 45 minutes Manchester United giving the ball away as usual you know cannot retain ball cannot retain possession you know Bruno Fernandes doing what Bruno Fernandes does Mark Rashford doing Marcus Trashford stuff. Crash Bandicoots, you know. Bruno Fernandes. With Manchester United conceding the first goal so early, I thought, what, within the first what, 12, 17 minutes, with Manchester United doing well against Bayern Munich, defensively set up in a way where they were okay. But as you know, Manchester United conceding that first goal, coming from, of course, um, a shot from... Who took the shot? Oh, I kind of forgot. Was it a signing shot? Signing shot. Signing shot. Butterfingers. Oh, nah, nah. Slipped it and then, and then of course, knocked it into the corner. Of his and it was so easy. Him himself was frustrated and annoyed with himself because what kind of mistake was that? Oh, nah, nah. But then the second goal, Serge Gnabry cut back. And Serge finishing it in. And Onana again looking like a suspect. Doesn't know what he's doing. Like, no attempt to save it to be fair and it's the same goal we conceded on the weekend against Brighton it's a similar goals that we conceded for the second goal it was halftime 2-0 guys I was like yep yeah, we, we, we're going we've lost this game but let's let's not get embarrassed imagine I went to that second half you know because they came they came out the second half very early they were out there for a long time Ten Hag must have shouted at them like hey hi this is not how I taught you just do better in a second off. Get the fuck out there and do some shit. Show these fans what you're made out of. Give me some balls, man. Poles and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, second off. Imagine that immediately making it 2-1. Rush Mish Hoyland again today. Finally scored his on his Champions League debut and was not denied by VAR, guys. And of course, he was thinking, oh, let's go. Man United back. I told everyone, calm down, tranquile. Manchester United were conceding two minutes and Manchester United conceded in two minutes. A oh, poor goal. I mean, no, wait, wait. No, it's not a poor goal. It was a penalty that we conceded. And Ericsson sticking his hand out. And, 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 and that was quite unfair. It was harsh. It was harsh on the referee. What can he do? Where can he put his hand at? Where, where can he put his hand? Nowhere else. But Ericsson, the referee said, you know what? It's a handball. Harry Kane scoring against Manchester United. Scored, scoring that goal, the penalty. And then Manchester United making it 3-2 in the second half. Coming back, Casemiro just finishing off with brilliant play for Manchester United. You know, a brilliant little interplay, but Casemiro finding that. And then it's 3-2 
Manchester United, can you do something? Can you come back? Do you know what Manchester United do when the pressure's on them? They give the ball away, as always. Like, to me, to you, here by Munich, you go and do your thing, and by Munich did their thing, making it 4 2. Tell scoring the fourth goal was brilliant play, brilliant. Opened up Manchester United really well to finish it off the roof of Onana. And Onana just looks p terrible, poor. You know, poor with one on one chances and situations. He's just not good enough. It's scary, you know. We, we got rid of the here for this. But yes. Again, what a crazy last couple of minutes because Manchester United making it 4 3. Casemiro with a header from a set piece and losing the game 4 3, respectedly, because that's what I wanted. Player wise, it was full time 4 1 and 4 3 to Manchester United. But player wise, I'm looking at Marcus Rashford, Bruno Fernandes, and Ericsson, Martinez. Lindelof, Onana, got another key players, and I just thought to myself, and even Pelestri, you was never there. You was never in this game. You know, Regulon, hats up to you, my friend. Like, you was my man of the match, you know. You showed us what Lucio hasn't showed us in so long. Like, Jesus, you can go by the past. Like, you can beat your man. You can cross the ball as much as you can. You've got a lot of pace. You know, you're hard to play against sometimes. But, oh, uh, Oh, I have to say, um, Reglan was good as well with Casemiro who had a weird game because he got ran through past by Jamal Musiala so many times, but I managed to score two goals. He sh he did his thing. He showed up. He scored his goal. Do you know what I mean? But hey, it is what it is, you know. And yeah, and of course, Hoyland with the goal, his debut goal. I'm pleased with that, but. Okay, Manchester United, you, you can't play this weekend like this. You you will lose again. And I'm worried about Manchester United. We're just not good. We're not strong enough as well. It's so much to take in because I know we've got injuries. We couldn't even fill 12 men on the bench, you know. That's how depleted our squad is. We have barely no option. Scott McTominay came on. Martial, Anthony Partial, Anthony, always getting injured, Martial. And we had to live with that, guys. Seriously, we didn't even make that much substitutions. Boy, 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 boy. It is what it is, man. Guys, this has been your match reaction. Guys, let me know what your thoughts in the comments of today's game. You let me know who your man the match is. And also, you let me know who your donkey of the match is as well, man. I'm back live tomorrow, 5 p.m. UK time for the latest Manchester United news. We are talking Ole Gunnar Social's interview. So make sure you tune in, guys. And I'm live again on Saturday, 7.40 p.m. UK time, guys. Remember that for the watch along against Burnley. As always, guys, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it red united. Your boy is out. Peace. Boop, boop.